in a city where everything feels so static, we come to the rescue. The radio station where they knock you with correct information, sports, news, with Obonge music from yesterday and today. We go make your belly sweet like honey. Now he be said, now every minute we go the hammer spy put on top of your face. Six point three FM. Okay, Gadjoki. So I'm on somebody's roof, and this is a good view of what Ibadan typically looks like. As far as the eyes can see, as far as the eyes can see, you can see like brown roofs. That's typical Ibadan. And because it's very hilly. You really get to see like very far once you're on the roof. At Agbowo, Orobon, Barika, Samonda, Songo, and other surrounding areas. I started the. Uh... Nigerian festivals and culture brought to you by Glow. Ibadan, a very important city in the history of the Yoruba nation and the capital of the modern day Oyo state. Okay, Ibadan festival. Even with the influence of Western religion and practices, the people cannot afford to relegate their own rich culture and tradition. Though different exciting activities herald
coolest city in West Africa. Welcome to Ibadan. Right behind me, right behind is coming to this great ancient city. I'm excited to go meet the people. Uh, the capital was few, as most filling stations stopped their gates, while others still sailed at the rate of 141 miles per liter. Well, however, major filling station at Agodi Gate in Ibadan and the NNPC Mega station has reverted to the new. Oh, yeah, come on. It's small, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Because I want to be If you don't be champion, there's no way you can stand up We wake up early, mama, put it down early, mama And trophies have bad trophies, but we know we let you want Show me your color, show me what you got. Make you carry your shoulder, 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 shoulder. I said champion. Look at the multi better, Ojo Baba 
Festivals and culture brought to you by Glow. Ibadan, a very important city in the history of the Yoruba nation and the capital of the modern day Oyo state. Festival. Even with the influence of Western religion and practices, the people cannot afford to relegate their own rich culture and tradition. Though different exciting activities herald Thank <laughs> you. 
Channels in the room cover, and you're made loaded with channels. It's not fair now. Ah, come here. Come here, come here, sorry. Deji. Come here, come This is Ibadan, city of seven hills, Ibadan, Nigeria, at the Premier Hotel, and Lola is up, it's early morning, it's about, I guess about eight something in the morning, we had a good night's rest. This is the place where my factory is. We saw the factory yesterday. Of course, I took some pictures. I didn't take a wide view. But if you look at the background, there's, this is a very hilly place. It is known, Ibadan is known for the seven hills of the Yorubas. Okay. People are coming into the hotel. 
far and near. I took a night shot last night. Let's get a closer up view. Some of the traffic and stuff. Telephoto lens. I don't know if it's going to come out as clear. It doesn't look like it is. That's uh, probably a little clearer. People driving up to the hotel. Men down there washing motorcycle and cars. Truck driver. <laughs> That's for you, Vincent. Truck driver. <laughs> okay. We're on top of a, um, one of the seven hills. That's where the uh, Premier Hotel is located. So enough of this scenery. See you later. Bye. Okay, now a lot of times we hear that music indeed is the food of love and if you love the music you want to hear the song over and over again now today we're not going to be talking about music uh, you know that Lagos is the bomb I'd rather live in the city than stay in the village but the question is which would you rather pick would you rather stay in the village or stay in the city you know looking at the freshness you know the nature that comes with you know the village life and all of that don't forget the name of the show his video wheels lifestyle and if you look behind me you're hearing noise you know like some natural noise of crickets and all of that don't mind me okay don't forget you can join us on www.gomind.tv i'll be back after this break my name is angela you're welcome Okay, you know that's what we do on the show. We take you out of the city. You know, we've been to several places. So just watch out your place, your uh, local place, like your village might just be the next stop for Video Wheels Lifestyle. Now, I asked the question before we did go to play that commercial, which would you prefer, the village life or the city life? Knowing fully well that if you stay in the village, you have ev everything fresh for you. And then when you look at some of the things people take, you know, take in, like eat in the village, you know, wear it for some. Okay, so which would you pick? We'll go out and ask people questions, you know, about which they would prefer either to stay in the city, you know, and just make yourself that city person or just stay back. Okay, today we're in Ibadan, the pace setter state. Uh, that's where we are. So we're going to go around, ask a few people questions. When we come back, you know, I might just be saying my bye-byes because you know the way it is. The weather, he's not my friend. He's not on my side. So I need to wrap this up quickly so I can get myself out of here so that another show can come up don't go anywhere we'll go ask these questions and i'll be back on the show you're welcome Wow, I've been in Ibadan all my life. Um, most people say, um, I'm in Ibadan, but uh, um, I grew up in Lagos, but uh, at least I was just in like, Ibadan. Very cool place now. You can see like everything is going peacefully. You know, like, place like Lagos where people are just jamming or something like that. Sha. Ibadan is a very good place and cool place for people to enjoy themselves. At least if you look along this ring road side, you see at least many clubs where you can have fun and chill out, something like that. Well, I'm from Ondo State, Wakaya, to be precise. Okay. I've been in Ibadan for the past 38 years. Um, I'm from Delta State, and I've been in Ibadan for nine months now. I came January. I found Ibadan as a peaceful place, but there's a peaceful place right here. It's a peaceful place, and everything is going on well. If you're a businessman or a businessman, yeah, you can make it, because it's a very large place. Uh, well, I would I would say it's fair. The life in Baden is is fair than other place that I know. 
because everything here, the only problem we have, you have no water. Pump water and uh, uh, food here are uh, limits. It, uh, food here is cheaper than other places. We are enjoying food here, yam, beans, and uh, gari. I would say all this are cheap here. Life in Ibadan is good now. It's better than that of your Lagos. Because here in Ibadan, there's no rushing, rushing like of Lagos. You know in Lagos, you wake up early, you will come back in late hour. But here in Ibadan, Ibadan is very easy. I mean, it's, if it's better than Lagos, to me, oh, it's better than another person. Sing, 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 song, song, sing. Oh, yeah, sing, 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 song, song, song. You better focus on your career instead of trying to cross my barrier. Talk to the talk to bring one night. I'm a man, them are real gone fire. Life in Ibadan is actually quite peaceful compared to Lagos. There is no rushing anywhere and having to be traffic all the time. It's peaceful and not so stressful. Life in Ibadan is very good. You see people going to their normal places of work. It's just cool. Everything's all right here. Ibadan people, they, are, they have respect. They are respectful. And Delta, I can't say they are not respectful, sure. they are respectful too. But, but Ibadan people, when they see their elders, they always greet. They always greet, they always appreciate, and I like the way they do. Ibadan people are very accommodating. Uh, they are hospitable, kind, and uh, Ibadan is very peaceful. Many people come from Lagos, you know, to reside in Ibadan, go to and fro from Ibadan to Lagos every day because of the serenity of the town. Security wise, Ibadan is okay, you can score Ibadan 80, 90 percent. I came here for visits anyway. Well, I school in Abiyokuta. So I don't know. Well, Ibadan is a peaceful place, it's okay, everything, fun and everything, it's a wonderful place. But well, I don't really know much about Ibadan because I grew up in Benin. So I was school in Abiyokta. Life with Ibadan. Life with Ibadan. Da. So when I was in Ibadan, I was in Ibadan. 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 Ni le se government wa gogo ru agugu o bere o oje ore mejeria ko si le se government kan kan be ko si gogo e lo si ye ki workers ki won ma ri se se me problem ta ni bad ni ko si problem pe ka ma da wa ala le tabi ja tabi wa ala tabi kan ko si yan sugba problem ke awon omode ma ri se se ki won ja de school ani to po badan and so far, I want to say, go go with your car way at my recess. Oh, life is good, very smoothly, going on smoothly, everything. You know, it's very easy. You can't compare Baron to Lagos because Lagos is very charming, charming, you know, but Baron is very easy, you know. I'm living in my little side here. For this Baron, it's very over okay, but come on, I want to hold you Come on, I see no man, no man. Well, I don't know, maybe you can identify because I'm an Ibadan indigent. Ibadan is very peaceful and well, okay. I think it's well to live in. Well, um, Ibadan is a nice place. Good um, tourism centers, as in, maybe for foreign people, shall. like places like the Kokodo side, like you want to relax, fine, and good electricity system. Um, it's about how you like present yourself to a girl, does no matter if you're bad or anywhere, shall. so babes are beautiful, at least in general, African babes are fine. There are clubs in Ibadan, there are a couple of clubs in Ibadan. We now have a 
No, we have two malls, actually. We have the Coco Mall and the Heritage Mall. We have a cinema. We have places you can hang out in Ibadan. Nice restaurants. Uh, that's uh, that's how it be. There are no other states that they are fighting, they are motor problem in this and that. You see our road now that it is free. Every go, everybody going uh, as you like. Yes, in Ibadan also we used to go to club now. But yeah, we cannot compare it together. Life day in Lagos than Ibadan for that one. No, me, I don't normally, I don't used to go to club. I uh, don't know, but I just somehow smoothly in Ibadan. Somehow going on smoothly in Ibadan. Uh, actually, if you can see, there is a, a bubbles, 411, and then time out because Solo your lady. Uh, if you go there on Friday or any other time, you will see that Faji is very okay in Ibadan. We are talking about okay. It's okay. <laughs> I think that they are still quite um, tied to the traditional ways, you know, the traditional ways of dressing, of speaking, of behaving generally. Oh, oh, bad dog, so, so small, you know, things like that. They still speak it generally and um, I believe that they still don't understand some things that are happening around because you can see that Ibadan is different from how it used to be a few years back. Now we have better roads and there is a, a little bit of beautification around. And you see that some of them still do not understand that they're not supposed to stand in some places, they're not supposed to throw things in some places, but I guess they'll catch up with time, I guess. What I can say about the accent is that uh, when a person that is from Ibadan is talking, you can easily identify that this person. You say when you want to, like when you want to pronounce season, they will say Z or something like that, I don't know. And the kind of accent that people use here. Well, let me see, I can remember one or two accents here. Like when you want to, when you want to pronounce zero, they will say zero or something like that. That's what I can say about the accent. The accent is not bad, it's not bad. It's good. People in Ibadan, we are nice now. They are kind people. People used to say that, that those who are born in Ibadan, that they love abusing people, that they used to say, so, see, if they are, even if they are speaking, they normally recognize them through their speaking, that at this one, you are from Ibadan. Hey, so, so, Gonkatimo, Sonny, something like that. They use so, see, for words, Sha. Ibadan, uh, Ole, Kebu, so, I want to get in our Ibadan. I want to be in Jebu, be a guy, be a do. We are very nice. We are very nice. We go on our own. But the only thing is that, uh, uh, the only thing is about uh, girls in Ibadan is that, uh, you know, we are not too sharp as Lagos girls. That's why they say maybe we are too abusive. No. We are so nice. Going on our own. Everything. Uh, actually, the, the common language from Ibadan, we see us that our language is very smooth. But if you want to know, the difference between Ibadan and Lagos, they don't know how to call E. Uh huh. If it's not, uh, this is a typical Lagos state, Lagosian. Oh. They will not, they won't know how to call E. Uh, so, show we, for example, show we, uh, you know, something like that. But we girls in Ibadan, we call it smoothly. For Lagos girls now, they will just say, uh, show, uh, oh, we are on it. But we girls in Ibadan, we call it smoothly. Show we are on it. Our, our, our Yoruba language very smoothly in our mouths. Well, um, Ibadan people are a variety of people. You have so many people in Ibadan, different temperaments, different upbringings. You have the funny people, you have the local people, you have the educated people, the enlightened people. So you have a variety of people in Ibadan. It's the accent, our accent, as in, you know, the intonation, the accent, and I don't, um, should I say it's because of the level of education. You know, we are not, we are not really exposed to more education, that's why, because um, to some extent we lack courtesy. 
even if a guy should approach you and even if you're not interested, there should be a way you, you know, communicate and everything will be, you know, it's settle everything amicably. But to some extent, we start flaunting, you know, show your opinion, are you, you understand? Sing, 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 song, song, sing. Sing, 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 song, song, song. You better focus on your career instead of trying to cross my barrier. Talk to the talk to bring on my life. I'm a man, them are real gun That's my best place if I came to Ibadan. Yeah. How often do you Morning, night, and afternoon? Oh, no. I can take a way to Anamala in the evening. In the morning, I can take light food like beverages. My favorite food? Well, <laughs> their food is Amala and Ewedu. Oh, they took Koko and Badan near Amala. Ibadan, you are Amala, they call Ibadan, Zaba, man, dead. Aro, I better man je amala. La de wo man je ko. E ko ati mai mai. Okay, now you heard what that man said. So I think the best thing is just for you to pack your stuff, you know, your luggages, and go back to the village. Yeah. <laughs>
It's really good.
interested is not G1, it's not nice, but his name is Isolate. It's from simply tied to Holland. Piano. Oh, piano.